So I've just had to Google how to boil an egg. Who knew? Welcome back. We are here for another full day of eating, but with a twist. I have got my husband who's going to be involved today. And what we're going to try and do is, well, he's going to try and um, eat 5,000 calories. I'm just going to see where I get to. So the dog has been walked and it is absolutely Baltic outside. So I've just stood in the warm shower for about 20 minutes trying to get warm. But um, yeah, let's get this day started. So I've had insatiable hunger the last couple of days, which is fantastic and very much unheard of with my condition. So I'm going to try and take advantage of that today and yeah, just enjoy myself and feed this body up, get the calories in and yeah, just smash this weight gain and just enjoy the journey along the way. So we've got a few things which we've got to get done today because we are moving house very, very soon. And yeah, we've got a few things. We've got to take stuff to the skip, um, but be sure I will take you along with us. Like the video, please subscribe, please share it. Please follow me on my Instagram and let's get going. What we're having is we're going to have some, some bacon. I've also got an egg boiling because I really fancied like egg soldiers. I've never ever boiled an egg before, like believe it or not, um, I've never made myself like a dippy egg. So I've just had to Google how to boil an egg. Who knew? So anyway, yeah, we're going to have that and then we're going to have one of these pitters with it, which is just the, these ones, the be freestyle pitters. That's the only thing I do like with being gluten free you cannot find like a good bread alternative that actually tastes like bread a lot of them just taste like i don't know um real real just starchy and stuff not very nice so actually i know what i can have i've just remembered i've got these so i think i'm gonna have one of these oh no it says bake eight to ten minutes no i can't bother to do that So I don't know what happened here guys, but I did film myself eating this bacon and egg sandwich, but when I look back at the footage, it had all gone blurry and I don't know, there was obviously something that messed up. So yeah, uh, fortunately I got a picture which I put on my Instagram anyway, but really sorry guys, uh, the footage of it had been lost, but please believe me when I say I did eat that. So guys, we are back with some snacks. Um, I've got a little bit of time before I need to go to drop some stuff off at the skip. So I found these the other day in Aldi. So these are ginger cookies. So I think I'm going to... Try a couple of them 
and then I've just got the famous that feature in every video uh, two chocolate chip rice cakes snacker jacks and then I've got a Nescafe coconut uh, coffee shop so let's open up these cookies and I'll show you guys so, these are obviously gluten free I can't see that there's any dairy ingredients um, but no butter or anything like that has been used so it should be fine So they're only tiny, they're only small, just like a little hobnob size. Let's have a look at the break. Oh, that went everywhere. Don't know whether you can see that or whether it's focusing or not. I really do like a ginger biscuit. They're so different, like a bit left field. Not many people like them, but. Oh. Oh, okay, so. I don't know what the ingredients are, but there's something chewy in there. Mm. It's crystallized ginger. Oh, that is really, really good. Okay guys, we're going to leave it there because I've only got like 15 minutes until I've got to get to the skip. I'm just going to finish my coffee and the rice cakes are... So we have just dropped off the stuff at the skip, which is absolutely freezing today, isn't it babe? It's really, really cold. Yeah. <laughs> um, and we are now at Kafuk KFC drive through because Tom wants a boneless banquet meal and two mini fillets is that what it is mm -hmm. with gravy and mayonnaise so I'm gonna get Tom that because um, he's not eating hardly anything today so I don't know what calories you're on babe you only had your Weetabix haven't you in a protein shake yeah um, I can't have anything from here which is rubbish um, that's the only thing with like gluten-free and dairy-free is it's just impossible for things like takeaways um, but yeah, we will. Uh, we'll see you when we've uh, we've got the food. You know, and I asked the lady. I said, "Do you sell anything that doesn't contain gluten?" And she said, "No, literally everything contains gluten." So that's annoying because I I would have got something. But um, Tom is slowly hacking away. So what have you already had now? You've already had two mini fillets. Uh, have you? Have you finished both? Yeah, two. What are they called? Mini fillet. Fillet burgers. Burgers. I'll have a look at your receipt to see what we got. So yeah, we ended up, Tom ended up getting two, oh, I don't say what it is. Oh yeah, so two mini fillet burgers and then two boneless banquet meals, which consist of fries, gravy, two Pepsi Max, two garlic mayo dips, and then what do you get, like six pieces of chicken or something? Mm -hmm. So he's two mini fillets down and then he's got, <laughs> he's got two of them to try and eat. How are you feeling, babe? Is it going down all right? It's good, yeah. <laughs> all good over here. So we'll catch up with you when uh, we've got something more interesting to talk about. So, so there we go, one one down, isn't it, honey? 
and you're feeling good, you're feeling fresh. Feeling good, feeling fresh, feeling ready. So you've had the two burgers. We actually worked out that that meal with the two uh, burgers is 2,600 calories, which is a good dent in the 5,000 because all you've eaten today is Weeabix. So we're saying yeah. Tom's at about 3,000, which is quite easy really to hit 2,000 for the rest of the day, I, I reckon. Mm -hmm. So feeling good, feeling fresh. And we are gonna go back home now. So see yep. you in a bit. So we are back. Tom is currently finishing off the rest of his bonus banquet meal. He's actually gone for a poo, so that's gone straight through him. Um, I'm gonna go out with Oreo now. Um, I'm just gonna take, I've got a bag of these which is the Boost Balls Protein Bites. And then I've got like half of a flump that I've been eating, so I'm gonna finish that. So I'm gonna go out with Oreo now and then I'll come back and then, yeah. Well, hopefully, I feel a little bit sick, I'm not gonna lie. Hopefully this little walk and the cold air, I've got a peppermint tea I'll take with me. Hopefully I'll feel a little bit better when I come back and less full, but um, yeah, I will see you in a little bit. So we are back from the walk and I am back in the dressing gown of peace. And um, I'm just gonna have a bowl of free from honey Cheerios with some coconut milk. I've got about 60 grams in there. Um, and then I'm going to go and start editing the video. Um, so yeah, that is just quickly a little snack from, I'm not sure whether I fancy tea tonight. I think I might just snack throughout the night. I'm not 100% sure yet. Yeah, I'm gonna see how I feel. But um, yeah, uh, so next you'll be seeing is editing. Mm. So the pasta is cooking and this is really what I'm craving right now. So it's one of the genius double chocolate chip muffins. I've already actually started it, so but it's really, really good. I really recommend this one. And then they've also got a blueberry muffin flavour. Shock that this one comes sniffing. <laughs> eh? You smell food from anywhere, couldn't you? She was limping about 10 minutes ago. Now she's, uh, you're ready to eat again, aren't you? If I had the metabolism of Oreo, I'd be rocking. Oi, you're not meant to have chocolate. Chocolate's not good for doggies. I always think the top is always the best part of the muffin, so leave that till the last. What do you think, Dorian? What's this? Mm. This has got really big chocolate chunks in, which is lovely. When's the last time I was able to do this, babe? Eat a snack while my tea's cooking. Something as dense as this as well. Mm -hmm. Ages ago. This probably would have filled my stomach up about, well, maybe even a month or two months ago. Yeah. Just this muffin. Mm -hmm. 
can only see on me right now, she's literally hanging on. Aren't you? Huh? She's not blinked this entire time. I need you a little bit, tiny, tiny bit. No? Come on, camera. Show the people what they want to see. Sit down then. Camera. Oh, now she's lying down. That won't work. There you go. She doesn't even chew, she just swallows straight. I always think with the chocolate muffin, you need a muffin milk, don't you? My mum used to um, do the bread breakfast at school. She'd bring the massive muffins that Morrison used to do. And every kid would have about four muffins and five pints of milk before we go to school. <laughs> We're probably all asleep, wouldn't you? You're not having any more. Hmm? Any more you have tea? How's the place? Yeah. Don't smash it with that KFC. It's like 2,600 calories, so he's going for a few hours. He doesn't even need to be. Okay. But he has a man about five poos. <laughs> That's fine, guys. Mm. And that is that. So, I'll see you when I've got pasta, which should be about two minutes. So I am about to have a big bowl of pasta. Uh, I've got about 200 grams of pasta. Um, I'm not going to film it because my camera's about to die, so I need to save the battery. But I'm going to quickly show you. Just got a little bowl of salmon because uh, hashtag health. And then I've got a big plate of pasta with some. This is like dairy-free cream cheese, and my body weight in ketchup as per usual. So yeah, I'm going to enjoy this, just pasta and king prawns with some peppers and cherry tomatoes, so yeah, I'm going to enjoy this and I will see you when I'm done. So pasta is all done and I feel fine, like I don't feel kind of too full, which is awesome, so I've just hit over 2000 calories, which is really really good um, if I can try and get kind of up to 2500 I'd be really really happy um, so we're just chilling we're watching the bay I don't know if you can see little Oreo <laughs> but yeah um, no I'm feeling fine it's about 7 38 now so I think I'll probably leave it a couple of hours and then probably get some food afterwards but yeah if you haven't seen the bay like it's really really good it's on itv player and uh the first series we watched was awesome now we're watching the second series and it's really really good so um but yeah i'll report back to you guys when um i'm gonna get some more food hey guys so it is now half past nine and i've had a lovely bubble bath and i feel okay so i am just going to end the night with one last snack so i'm gonna have this biotech zero bar and i'm just gonna probably have a little bit of this bunny obviously i've had i've had the head um a few days ago so I'm just going to finish this. this, is lush by the way, it is the dark 60% one. Um, so I can have about 75 grams and then um, it turns like, it switches from low fob mat to like medium. Um, Tom is on about... Well, he's actually not eaten anything since that KFC, but I think he's on about 3,000 something. Um, but that's his Ben and Jerry's. He's gonna, he's got about half of that left, so he's gonna finish that. So he'll, he'll be decent. Um, I think he'll be near 5,000, so he's doing actually really, really well. But, um, but yeah, uh, that is it for this full day of eating because I'm gonna go upstairs and have this with a cup of hot Ribena in bed and uh, call it a night so thank you again so much for watching um again please like and subscribe really really appreciate um your views this is the last video you'll be seeing in this house um because we'll be hopefully moving that's meant to be cross fingers hopefully 
moving on Wednesday, so it's uh, Friday today. So hopefully moving on Wednesday. Uh, if not, it will be the following Saturday. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.